starting the video off tonight with what we had for dinner. So roast potatoes that I did in the air fryer. I did pork chop with mushroom and onions in the crock pot. Some California mix, glass of wine, and two dinners for the truck driver to take on the road with him. It's right here. Hi everyone and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 12. Right? 12. I guess. I hope everyone is doing well and that you are participating in um, Advent calendars because they are a lot of fun and we both have a glass of wine here so cheers. Cheers too. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You can sit them over there. So we just finished dinner. All the animals are sleeping. Lazy, lazy, so they are. And that's all right, because we have peace and quiet for a bit. <laughs> so we are on day 12. So day 12 is right there. That's the, um, right there. That's the, uh, the crunchy bee. Let me give that one to RJ. Pardon? Oh, it's not in there? All right, we'll have to go fishing for them. I believe all the treats have fallen to the bottom because I do have these standing up. Yeah. There she be. So I think the weather is going to change tonight. We had, um, it was nice and mild today, but you could tell the wind was coming in and you could feel the coldness coming in with it. So we are supposed to get snow. I can't see number 12. Number 12 is right there. It's right there. I cannot get any relief from this sore arm. So I'm actually going. I have an appointment on Friday to go see a doctor. Hopefully get some relief. Some sort of relief anyway. Oh yeah, they like those ones too. Turn it around. So that's a little... um. I believe it was chicken, the chicken disc, turkey slider, turkey slider. And if you noticed in yesterday's uh, haul, while I was opening them and I had given some to Mac, little sneak came right up and helped himself to uh, Rosie's. Yeah, that little sneak of him. See, <laughs> one of these just fell out. I don't know where that one came from because it's all closed up. Well, that's weird. Number 12, that's the last one on this side of RJ's book. But one, one fell out, so it must have fell out from that side. It was the night before Wolfmas. Wolfmas? Because we gave it to him yesterday, didn't we? Yeah. Oh, Pretty yeah. sure we did. Yeah. So there's a red one that he's getting today. I don't know where this white one fell out of because we're finished that side. I don't know. I'll hang on to them. Yep. Alrighty. Uh, I'll do Onyx's little cat one. And this is her toy 12. We'll have to look for it. Just popping this out. We'll give her her treats after. She's even sleeping tonight. If you bring it over, I can help you. Well, I, see, I think I see 13. My goodness, this man has glasses and he breaks them constantly. The screw fell out, but that's another story. <laughs> Definitely another story. We don't have time for that story. Do you know what? I don't even see it myself. There you go. Imagine All that. right, we have a problem. There's 15, 21, 18, 24, 13, 25, 23, oh, so 20. That's 19. Oh, 12. Oh. Found it is right there. <laughs> that window. And I think her treats have gone from here. Oh, no, they're in there. Oh, What's she getting today? Another little ball? She enjoys these. She's had a few of those in it. This one's a red one with a bell in it. I won't shake it too much. She might come roaring down here. Crazy cat. Oh, I gotta do my jewelry. 
So we're doing my charm bracelet. Let's see what um, charm we have. So I got them all on. I will probably rearrange them all because uh, now the last few days I've been opening hanging ones. There's another hanging one. Oh, this one's pretty. It's a um, it's a red wreath with a green bow. That's a little different. Can you see it? So yeah, I'll be putting that one on after. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, people. I don't know. Good thing I love you. It's a good thing I love you. Oh, is that how? It is? <laughs> yes. Here you go. Thank you. Scratch what are we doing? Scratch miss. Scratch miss. Maybe you need like an Irish whiskey miss. <laughs> I need something. The pain, it's getting to me. All right, I need my scratcher too, please. So we're doing 12. 12's over here on the, uh, your right side, our left side. And you took away my box I was using. It's okay, I'll use my hard knee. Ooh, this is really close. Is that what I think it is? Are you for real? No. No, that's got too many zeros. Phew, that was a close one. Sean got 5,000. No, sorry, 50,000. 50,000. And this one looks like it says, um, there's too many zeros. One, two, three, four, five. That's 50,000. 50, one, two, three, four. Five is, um, it's a higher number. It's not. Well, Very see. close, but it has, it doesn't have enough, it does not have enough they zeros. No, they don't. Put my glasses on and okay. have a look. Let me have a look here. You have a look, because it's All not. Right. It would be nice. Oh, it's a five hundred thousand. Five hundred thousand and two fifty thousands. <laughs> Damn lottery. <laughs> Can I have my specs back, please? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'd rather see it without. Oh, our ring light went out. It's been very uh, weird lately. Yeah, it's made in China. What do you expect? I got a fifty thousand. Hold on, did you just hand me yours again? <laughs> Mine's no. just happy. <laughs> okay. Oh, just don't your, make me laugh. You just keep it's your seasoned too. card there. I'm seasoned. I got uh, 5,000, 50,000, and 500,000. Isn't that funny? We both got all the fives. Huh. Shall we scratch a bonus tonight? Sure. Let's scratch all right, a bonus. which one? One, two, or three? Oh, pick a number between one and ten. No. One, <laughs> two, three. You've only got three. Why would you go one to ten? Just to see if you would go for it. No. I'll take seven. <laughs> no, I would have said six. Well, but we only <laughs> have one, two, or three. Right. Come on now. Well, let's do two. Two. Okay. I'm going to go put the light on so we can do our haul. So we have to match three things here, right? Or, I forget what it said. Oh, it said if you had an, an amount, you won that amount. Yeah. And all I got was, uh, good. I got Mary. Excuse me. <laughs> you scratched three, but you chose two. I said two. That's the middle That's one. That's the middle one. <laughs> Hey, I can't laugh tonight. One, two, three. No, 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 no. Listen. One. We already scratched one. Yeah. No, no, no. Two, three, four. Yeah. He scratched one, three and I two, scratched two. Three. Two is the middle one. All right, what are you? I'm good. You're what? I'm Mary. <laughs> so you're happy and Mary? I'm happy and Mary. I got a season's good. At least I think that's what it says. <laughs> I can't read it. Okay, wait. I can see if I can put this light back on. Just unplug it. If that doesn't work, I'm putting on the overhead. Is it working? Well, it's a blue light on? No. Happy Mary. This is Happy Holidays. No, that's his Happy. 
holidays. Oh, happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Yes, see yourself. Oh, so seasons mine says greetings seasons. And... Greetings. Good tidings. I tell you, what do we like? All right. So, um, our haul today is going to be a thrift store haul. Uh, we did this. I'll check the receipt what day we were actually there. But we had to drive down to um, Winkler, Manitoba. So, very close down to the border there. Uh, the U.S. border. And uh, it was a Monday. We had an appointment. And afterwards, I said I wanted to go into the MMC thrift store. Because it was right by the building we were going to. But they don't open on Mondays. So then Sean said, um, uh, we had to retorque the tires because you had just put on the snow tires. So where did we go? Okay tire. In Was it okay tire? Yeah, so I googled okay tire and we found it. And as we're driving over, I saw this other big thrift store and it was open. So we went in there. I'll tell you the name of it when I look at the receipt. But can you lift that up? Sure. Oh, so I threw my scratcher down. So the first thing that I'm going to show you is, was this little um, wooden shelving. It's so cute. I could put my little um, cricket, cricket uh, cuties in it if I wanted. So it does say um, House of Measure. And it says Carlsbad. Carlsbad? California. No, it's not California, is it? No, Carlsbad Cabins Cabin. National Park, but it's war out there. Don't know which national park it is. I got that for it's 50 just cents. It's Carlsbad Caverns. Oh, right. Yeah, but where is that? What state? That's what I'm trying to say. Ah, uh, I forget. I don't know. We'll have to look that up. Because a lot of the caverns are around um, Missouri and stuff. Yeah, and there's yeah. The, one of the crystal caves. But anyway, I got that for uh, 50 cents. Show them our big roaster. Give me the lid. That way I could sit this stuff right into it. Okay, so we bought this roaster, and it is, I'm going to say, from the 1940s, maybe earlier. It's the enamelware. Uh, you can tell by the color, so it's cream color with the green trim on it. And I looked on, um, I looked online to see what something like this was selling for, and there was actually one at the time. They had it listed for three hundred dollars. I thought that's crazy. You know, we paid eight dollars, so we're not going to use it. It does have a quite a bit of rusty bits and all in it. I just want it for a display in the kitchen with all my other goodies. Um, here's the receipt. So the store was called uh, Gospel Echoes Thrift Store in Winkler, Manitoba. And we were there. It's a good thing it didn't say Gospel Hall. <laughs> <laughs> we were there on, actually it's a month ago. We were there on the 14th of November. So that's how long I've had this sitting in my craft room waiting to be hauled. <coughs> so, how about we show like this first, what's on the top? This is wrapped around the giant oh, wine glass. Oh, it is too. Okay. Oh, go. look at that. The first item is a wine glass. No, the first item is this. <laughs> okay. Did we not get a pair of these? Nope. Oh. Saw this white, this wine glass and... Um, it's purple little bubbles in it. It looks really pretty. I paid 50 cents. The Ten price is, oh no, sorry. 25 one. cents, 25 cents. Makes me happy all the time. I love these lace uh, doilies as I call them. And this one was 50 cents. cents. And it's a nice long one for like a dresser. I love it. I'm gonna wrap it around my white glass again. Okay, yeah, we got some Christmas items. So this was um, a Christmas mug for 25 cents. And it's a uh, navy blue with the holly on it. I love it. And you kind of got the two little, and my fingers won't fit through there, but yeah. Even just to sit out as decor with something sitting in it at Christmas time. Next. Oh, we bought a bag of um darning needles because we wanted to repair 
RJ's harness that he keeps fighting out on. Uh, so these were big darning needles for 35 cents. And then this one says 50 cents. I think we took a few out, but look at this for a needle. This one out. Oh, there is one out? Yeah. I, look at that for the size of a darning needle. I stitched it with welding wire so it fights through that. Yeah. We will have a problem. <clears throat> What's next? The egg. -er. Oh yeah, I saw these really cute egg. Um, I love having a boiled egg and toast for breakfast. So this one was really pretty. It's got little pink flowers on it. I may have got a few more of these. 25 cents. Like their prices were unbelievable. I wish that we lived closer to that store. I'd be in it all the time. And my mug, you can show them. That mug was 25 cents with the little sweater cozy Santa. on it. Mm -hmm. Santa's on both sides. Yeah, yeah, all their mugs for 25 cents. Value Village should uh, take a lesson from these. They're pricing people. 25 cents. That's another vintage piece, like a, a jam or relish dish. It may have had spoons with it because it is cut out on both sides, but that's okay. So 25 cents, it's heavy, so it's definitely sterling silver. It doesn't have any marking. Oh, it does. You won't be able to see that. Um, <laughs> oh, I can't even read it. Read my magnifying. Bon, bon Teal Silver Plated. So it says Silver Plated. It's nice. All right. Oh, yes, I forgot about that. A crystal sleigh. Beautiful. I know which chocolates I'm sitting in that. What did we pay for it? It's on the bottom. A dollar. A dollar. It's beautiful. Sit it in there because it's probably heavy. Thank you. What's in my hat? Oh, here's the... Uh... Oh, yeah, so we had two two egg uh, boiled egg holders for now. Four. Oh, yeah, I did buy four. I thought there was a set. Four. One, two, three, and we already showed you that one. Good. I can, yeah, there's one here. I put it in here. Next. So, yes, for a dollar, I got a set of four. These are beautiful. I'll try that out. And what is this? It's marked. Yeah, this is another little vintage um, basket, ceramic basket. We paid a dollar for it. I'll try and read the markings. It actually has a stamp on it. Um, yeah, I can't read it. But I can't see where it was made. Well, that's Italian. Yeah, probably Italian. All right, let's try not to break all this lovely stuff. Oh, well, you found that, so we had to have it. It's a figure skater. And if uh, Nanny is, uh, have heard that uh, I was a figure skater, I started figure skating uh, when I was seven years old. When I was 18, I started coaching. And I coached right up until about, what would you say, eight years ago? Um, is it eight years already? You've yeah. Been yeah. No. Oh, yeah, I have. Mm -hmm. Um, so I love this. This was 25 cents. Were they 25 each? Are they supposed to go together? Yeah. Oh, 25 each. Love it. That's that, um, pewter, isn't it? Yeah. It's a product of China, but it is pewter, yeah. Yeah. All right, so I did get that. I love Just it. Just don't eat tomatoes on pewter. Actually, I do have a lot of new subscribers, so welcome. Welcome, welcome. Did Maine. you find this or me? I did. So made Sean found Japan. this. Oh yeah, so made in Japan. So that dates back to nineteen twenties. Yes, nineteen twenties. And we paid three twenty five for that. None of the petals or anything are damaged. No. Can you maybe sit it over there so I don't break yeah. it? Very pretty. Really good price. 
If it said, no, before 1920 was Nippon. Nippon, yeah. Yeah, like and then it went... Uh, Japan. Japan. And now what is it? Made in Japan. Yes. Made in Japan. Yeah, we found this teapot made in Japan. It's it's brown with some silver on it, but a beautiful pattern on the front of it. Yeah. What was the price? A dollar. A dollar. I so want to go back to that store. It's just a small teapot. Again, it'll just be on display. Yeah, see, this one's made in Japan. Yeah, made that in one. Japan. So this is the 1950s. That's that's newer, yeah, because if it just yeah. says Japan, it's that's older. Pre-World War yeah. II. Now I'm surprised these aren't marked because they kind of remind me of something English. Yeah, like With your, the uh, roses, yeah. Oh. oh, I bought a little knitting book I saw. Um, that's actually one that I don't have. I used to knit all for my kids. I wish I could knit for the grandkids, but mm -mm, not happening. There's some really cute patterns in it. This was 25 cents. 25 cents. And it's patterns. So I owned these books back in the uh, late 1980s. Oh, uh, This one will come out 1995. Yeah. So we got that. What else do we got? Springs. You bought springs for? My airlines. For his airlines on the transport. So now yeah. you can take those. Well, I don't know. If it's going to work? Yeah, because it's been reconfigured. Oh, right. Yeah. Do we have anything else to show? Nope. And where did I put the receipt? I gave it to you. Well, I know that. I just don't know where I put it. So, can you believe that all of this was less than $20? Could not believe it. If we were in Value Village, we'd be at about $100. Yeah. We paid with tax nineteen twenty five. So we were very pleased with those finds. Very pleased indeed. So I hope everyone enjoyed our vlogmas today. And uh And don't take offense to the t shirt. Mrs. Brown oh. put her mouth on her. You can't stop it. <laughs> Have any of you seen Mrs. Brown's Boys? It's actually an Irish comedy, and it's the family that actually act in it, and the the father is Mrs. Brown. And so uh, let them see what it says. She always says, that's nice. Now feck off. Now feck off. <laughs> <laughs> Not you guys. <laughs> Not you guys. No, 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 no. We want you guys to stay. But yeah, that's just Mrs. Brown's t-shirt. Yep. She's the best. My parents actually went to see it, a live show in Toronto, and uh, I don't think they've done one because I would love to go to that. They haven't been back since. No, they haven't been back since. And apparently they're coming out with some new uh, shows. Yeah. The one that we like to go see is Jeff Dunham. Oh, yeah. He's funny. Yeah, we love Jeff Dunham too. Ackman's my favorite. I like Walter. Yeah. He's my favorite. <laughs> Grumpy old bastard. He is grumpy. <laughs> Anyways, everybody have a good night and uh, we'll catch you on the next video tomorrow. Bye for now. Later. <laughs> Mr. Camera Shine, apparently. I hate cameras. <laughs> you just you just forget that it's on. It's staring me in the face. Yeah, but when I was figure skating. Er, and I also worked at the arena. I would drive the Zamboni. I just pretended that I was a fish in a, in a. <laughs> Honey, I drive a transport and then before that, I was in. I was a fish in a fish tank and I just area. ignored everybody that was standing watching me. Yeah. But I, you've been, yeah, behind a wheel. Many wheels. Many wheels. Yeah. Many years. 109 howitzers. Or one five five. Thirty six years ago. Okay, so what's the difference? What are you trying to say? I said, no, there's nobody watching me. There's nobody watching you. But you remember, you used to come and watch me skating and and uh, the Zamboni. You have to just. Uh, see, you have well, to just. A reason uh, there, like, I have my reasons why I can watch you skate. Yeah. Okay, but uh, enough. Um. <laughs>
<laughs> but you you have to learn how to just block everybody out and do your job. And this is kind of the same thing. Well, thanks, Sigmund Freud. What? <laughs> what did you say? I said, thank you, Sigmund Freud. Who's that? He was the one of the first psychiatrists. I ain't no psychiatrist. <laughs> I might need one, actually. Anyways, <laughs> bye for now. We'll catch you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>